Hey everybody, the manga's back. Welcome to part 20 of Let's Play Shin Megami Tensei. Brought to you by GameAnyone.com Okay, after doing a fair bit of level grinding, and I mean a severely fair amount, I'm now at level 42, and I picked up a new weapon from those, uh, Rakshasas you fight in the uh, Shibuya Mansion, that's where I was level grinding, called a Renki no... something. It's a very powerful weapon, so I figured I'd equip it. Alright, now time to summon some demons. Um, I'll go with... Maybe I should take a look at my uh, demons first, like their stats, see what spells they got. Okay, so Mizuki has Yanga, Critical, and Sukukaj. Okay, that's a nice selection. And the Sunny Ya, I don't think he has any magic. Just Paralyzing Attack, Poison, and Blood Strike. I think that it just drains health. That seems like a pretty good, though he's not going to be reliable for magic. Orobas, I already know about. He's more of a support character. Yakshini I know about because she can heal, recover poison, and charm enemies. Raka, Raja Nag does Zianga, Rakukaj, and Wall of Something, so that's definitely a plus. What's that other one? Dekarabi. So Mahazan, Tetraka, and Tetraja. Another very good support character. So, I think I will go with the setup of Orobus. And let's see. Raja Nag. And. I think I'll go. I'll actually go, I'm gonna go with Yakshini, because I need a good charmer. Alright, now I need to head over east to a town called Rapangi. Which I believe is over this way. I'm just gonna make my way through the maze of all the uh, destroyed houses. And that's not gonna help me. Yeah, I just gotta go this way. Uh, no. Worthless amount of experience. Very disappointing. Yeah, I think I gotta go this way. Keep going east and then south a little bit. Eventually I'll come across Rapongi. Oh, Jaryu Worm. Um, I'm not interested in fighting. Damn. amount of damage to my demons, unfortunately. Yeah, I think that's good. Probably won't need to hurt it too much. Because worms aren't that great. There we go. Now we're down to one already. Now we're down to none. And four more worms. Ah, I'll out of this. That was easy. Okay, am I close to Rapongi yet? Ah, yes I am. Apparently there seems to be a barrier around it and I can't reach it. Therefore I might have to go through that building over there to get to the other side. This kind of reminds me of how to uh, get over to the American Embassy. Except there was no barrier, you just had to go through a building that was underground, and there you go. This is virtually the same concept. Ah, larvae. There, we had the first strike. Another Pishasha. Ah, like eight of them. Luckily, they're very easy. Okay, I got a few charm, but they shouldn't last this turn. See? Nice amount of experience, I like that. Now we can just keep going. Huh, I 
was a very short tunnel. Now we're actually inside the barrier. So let's go. Hmm. What's over this way? Just another shopping area? Oh, that's a dead end. So is that. But so far, I'm not seeing any demons. So why don't I return my demons back for now? That way they don't use up too many unnecessary magnetite. Ooh, a terminal! Oh, that's perfect! Now I can get around any time. Yeah, I'll keep playing. I mean, that's why I'm here. Okay, so if there are no demon encounters, I might as well just explore everywhere until I find everything. Gives me a good idea of where I'm heading. God, there's so far no people either. Mm, junks! Nobody's here. Well then, anything in armors? No. Okay, now I'm getting suspicious. Well then, can't do any shopping if there's nobody there to take the money. I mean, why can't I just go over the counter and steal the stuff? Like, really now? Wouldn't that be a cool thing to do? Like, hey, I can't shop. Oh, I might as well just steal this shit. It's just right there. Why can't I steal it? Like, it's just begging to be stolen. Really now? Well, like I said, I'm just gonna go through every path I see. Just to make sure I get everything. At least this place can't be as complicated or more so than Shinjuku. Because so I hope not anyway. Those red and black guys put a force field around Rapongi. With that force field up, the demons can't get in. That's why this place is free of them. Oh, so the force field has everything to do with the demons not being here. I wonder what happens if that force field is gone. I'm guessing the demons come crawling in? That would make sense. Oh, treasure box. Aww. I thought I was going to get some treasure, but I got disappointed in the end. Oh well. Better luck next time. Anyways, let's just keep going. Okay, so I just turn left and go through the other path. There we go. stairs. Ah, this goes down. I don't want to go down. And nobody in here. Ah, an elevator. Okay. So I'm getting some things discovered. Now then, how big is this floor anyway? Okay, well, fairly large, yes. There's no denying that. Well, I might as well just go in the elevator and go back out, just to officially mark it on the map. still haven't went this way. Actually, there's still a square over there I haven't filled. Disco! Welcome! Yeah, I'll come in. Inside here, there's a girl that they keep locked up. Her name was... Yuzu! I think that was it! Poor kid's been possessed by a demon. They had to lock her up. 
Otherwise, she'd go on a rampage and tear up the place. I feel sorry for her, but there's not much else they could do about it. Well, I got news for you, lady. She's here and she's free. Ah, <laughs> so we win. A girl is in prison here. That's... That's Yuzu! My Yuzu! She... She's alive! It's a miracle! But... Why isn't she aged? She looks exactly the same as she did before. But 30 years have passed since then. How could this be? Shinta! Is that you, Shinta? Shinta, you're alive! Yuzu! Yuzu, I... No! Stay away! Don't come near me! Even though I look the same, I'm... not! I didn't survive the bomb! I died in the blast! I know! It doesn't look like it! This town is nothing but a town of corpses! The dead! Reanimated and kept alive by the Red Count and the Black Baron! I too! Was one of the revived! Turned into a Bodiconian! But unlike the others, my memories of my human... my life as a human remain! That's why they've locked me up in here! Since I'm a Bodiconian, I cannot die, and I'm trapped like this! Soul incense! If only I had some soul incense, I could be freed! Please kill me! Um, do I have any soul incense? Um... Uh, let's see... No, no, I don't want to go to equip, I want to go to discard. That way I'll go through all the items I have. Uh, I don't have soul incense. Eh, I'll come back here later. Once I get some. Welcome! Uh, I don't want anything to drink. Neither does he. Or she. Let's talk. This is Rapongi. It's an oasis of peace within the violent land that is now Tokyo. Thanks. Best conversation ever. Every day it's nothing but fun. This place is heaven. Yeah, for you. Wow, was I ever right? Running away from Shinjuku to get here. Not a demon in sight. I think I'm finally safe. Oh, good for you. Okay, so I'll come back here later once I get the soul incense. Then I can free her. It's just the right thing to do. Rapongi is controlled by two men. They call themselves the Red Count and the Black Baron. But I don't get why they act so high and mighty. What with all the time they spend around that little girl. I wonder if they're just tired old men molesting her or something. Oh, you would never get away with stuff like this in North America in games. Man, all the dialogue you hear, it's crazy. Oh, I still haven't explored these little areas. Okay, so let's do that first. I still need to fill in that square. Oops, I have to go left. I'm Alice! Hey! Hey! Where did you come from? Hey, hey, Mr. Bonga! Do you like this town? I want a friend. Will you be my friend? Please? You know, this town Mr. Red and Mr. Black made it for me. Oh, I know! You should meet Mr. Red. I'll tell him to let you in. Um, thanks. Okay, I wonder if he doesn't mind being called Mr. Red. Seriously, it sounds like a very weird name. Yeah. Anyways, I think I'll just keep going. And there's nothing in this room, too. Okay, what squares have I not been at? Well, basically the only squares I need to go to are exits. 
Therefore, I think I will head over to where I can buy some soul incense, which is likely a kaif kaifuku. So I'll be right back and I'll meet you back here. Okay, I'm back. I had to apologize in advance when I said the soul incense was bought by Kaifuku. That was actually the soul returner that uses Hanma magic. The soul incense, you had to go to Rags and Shinjuku to exchange a diamond for it. Thank god I, I got a diamond because there was only one I had and I had to use it to get the soul incense. So, here we go. No! Stay away! Don't come near me! Alright, that's pretty much the same dialogue. Soul incense! Please kill me! Uh, yeah, I'll use it. Ha ah, ha! Ah, my body is... Ah. Thank you! Now I can finally die! I feel... at peace right now! Thank you! Yuzu, I wanted to see you once more, but not like this. Well, now you don't have to see her at all, ha <laughs> ha. I am uh, so offensive at times. Anyways, I think now would be a good time to head over to the second floor. Oh, just nearby. Alright, let's do it. up. Oh, now they got the epic music all of a sudden. What? Oh, don't tell me. They have these floors where you can get poisoned. Really now? Well, at least you can heal your own poisoned. Poison, I mean. That's speed incense. Yeah, I'll use it. And myself. There. So apparently some floors are rigged with traps, like that spot over there. The thing is, you pretty much have to guess in advance on what doors are rigged, or what floor spots are rigged. But you have no way of knowing unless you had a map, and well, there aren't any. They say that the Red Count and the Black Baron have some really important jar that they keep safe somewhere in this town. I wonder how much it's worth. Well, Will Smith, I'd tell you if I knew. Why do I keep calling that Sprite Will Smith? They pretty much got the same kind of hairstyle, like back in the Fresh Prince days. Door is sealed with a powerful magic. Therefore, I can't go through it. And there's another poison spot that two people are poisoned. Oh God. Oh, didn't work. I was better off with poison D. Oops, not not you. Pretty much have to figure out what squares are safe and. Wait, no, I'm poisoned. Yeah, I think I'll just keep going till I lose too much health. I mean, right now there are no demons to deal with. So I can just keep going at my own leisure. Until the damage gets a bit too severe. Which we're not at yet. Uh, okay. Did I go through this door? I think I did. Yeah, I did. Just try to fill in as much of this map as I can. Let's see if I can find any more treasure. There's the elevator. Just mark it in for later. I wonder if there's anyone else to talk to. Damn poison! 
Like, who breaks an office floor like this? Come on, now. I thought it would be just insurance people to break the floors of poison so they don't get too many claims come in. Ugh, I better not give them any ideas. Um, let's see. I haven't gone around that way. Mapper spell has expired. Nobody here. Why did I turn to face a wall? Hmm. Anything good here? There better be. No? I was expecting some treasure. Really, now. I haven't even found the uh, stairs to the third floor yet. And that door in the middle that can't open yet. I'll have to come back later. I suppose at a later time that door should open. Or maybe I just need an item for it first. Great. Okay, that's just where I came from. Oh, the second floor was right there. Oh my god. I don't think now would be a good time to purge all this poison. Wait, what magic does Yuzu have? Oh, a Toraport. Yeah, with that I can actually teleport back to the, uh... What was it? That, uh... The terminal, yeah. Like the nearest terminal I used. Okay, let's go. Gee, I wonder how many poison floors are on this spot. Oops, I don't want to cast any more magic. Suppose I find some good stuff. No, not yet. Something tells me something here is important. But why don't I explore these non-important spots first? I might find someone good to talk to. Treasure box! What? <sighs> Come on, game. Why you gotta pull all this bullshit on me? A rigged chest. Come on, now. No, oh, I didn't want to use Mapper. He was already active. A trap chest! Seriously! I didn't have a way to disarm that. Mistress, please don't. Ah, you came! I just asked the sec secretary to let you in. Mistress, you have my deepest apologies, but I have direct orders not to let anyone in. You won't listen to me? No, 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 no! Uh, very well. Please wait here while I look inside. The Red Count says that he will see you. Please go in. Isn't that great? Okay, I'll go on ahead. I'll see you later. Um... Yeah, I'm leaving. All right, but I can I come back any time? Oh, yes, I can. I'll deal with that later. First, let's explore. Because we can. Okay, a chest that didn't blow up in my face. That is so great. Oh, there was nothing in that spot anyway. Okay, did I explore all of this floor? Well, no. I don't know why, but I'm usually a map whore for places like this. Can you blame me? We all don't want to get lost. By doing this, we won't have to. And there's the elevator. 
there. Now that spot is filled. And I guess I can just go back to see the red count. I don't think there's anything else for me to see, is there? And... no, there isn't. Then I can just go in. So let's go. Sure, I'll go in. Um, just in case, why don't I bring in my demons? Because something big is about to happen and I want to be prepared. There. It seems like a decent team. How big is this spot anyway? I'll tell you, a little bit too big. Nothing in here. How about door number two? Ah, there's the lucky winner. Oh, welcome. So you must be the ones that Alice wanted me to meet. That's right, Mr. Clean. I mean, Red Count. She's quite a lovely girl, that Alice. We built this town and put a force field around it so that she can live in freedom, without the fear of being attacked by demons. Why can't you put that everywhere? You make a lot of money. Oh, hang on, time out. Okay, I'm back. Some dude wanted to sell me a cell phone. Which I already have. Now, I apologize, but I'm an extremely busy man. If you'll please excuse me. Mr. Red is pretty busy, you know. Yeah, he just told me a few seconds ago. Hey, hey, can I ask you a question? You know, I like a Hiranya. Hey, can you buy me a Hiranya? Um, sure. Yay, I'm so happy. Come back with one soon. Well, I already bought a few because they're good for healing HP and MP. So they're not too expensive. The strength incense. Um, uh, yeah, I think I'll use it on myself too. There, my HP goes up as well. Only by six points, but it's good. There you go. I have another question for you. Could could you please die? Um, no. You won't do what I ask? Way, you're so mean, you're so mean! Mr. Red, listen, that big boy was so mean to me! There, there, what's the matter, Alice? You see, I asked the big kid to die, <laughs> but he wouldn't do it! Way! I wanted to be with him forever! Way! I asked him nicely! Way! I see, I see. There, there now, Alice, don't you worry. Mr. Red will see to it that you get your wish. What? Oh, Mr. Red is ugly looking little bitch. Apparently he got a stroke because he's wincing with that eye. Okay. Here's the thing. You cannot beat this boss. At all. So, if I were you, I would just defend for the rest of this battle. Because you are not going to win. Like watch, I'll try attacking and it won't work. It's not working! Okay, so... Why don't we try magic? I'll see if that works. Everyone else defends, we at least got one person using magic. No effect. Guns don't work. My magic's ineffective! And we ran away. Well then, there's nothing we can do to beat this boss. Yes, I'm leaving, and apparently the secretary didn't notice the damn thing. But... One guy that looked like Will Smith did mention an important bottle stashed away. Oh, I thought I already opened that. I guess not. Like, there is one treasure 
that is stashed away in a room we haven't been through. That would be the basement. I'm going to stop the video right here, and next part we're going to go check that basement out. See ya, everyone.